There was so much excitement and optimism, followed by fallout with a coaching change. And tonight our own Stu Boyer has the story of how head coach Greg Paulus managed to keep this team together, competitive, and was ready when opportunity came knocking. It could have been disastrous. Just 15 days before Niagara's season opener, Patrick Beeline resigned as the Purple Eagles head coach. You never know when opportunities are going to come. Anytime you get a, you get a new coach, you got to start over. Greg Paulus was already on the staff and got great input from a number of coaches he played for, like Thad Mata and Mike Shashevsky, among others. Just to be myself. One of the reasons I wanted to get into coaching was because of the relationships I have with them. The confidence and, and the belief in, in just, hey, you're ready, go do it, um, is something that uh, I, I am appreciative of, and, and uh, we've tried to trust our instincts and, and, and follow our heart when, when leading. Paulus' approach seems to resonate with players. He just always wants feedback, he, as well as we you know, want feedback of how good of a player we are. He also wants to know um, what he needs to do better as a coach, you know, and he's open to different ideas from his players, so that's very cool. While it may not be the season many were hoping for, it's most likely a far better season than many expected, considering the circumstances. Stu Boyer, Channel 2 Sports.